So many great opportunities during Black History Month to learn and taste from different regions, too, to get a full experience. At Salt City Market this February, an expert in black history will join chefs from three different regions, each pivotal to the black experience. Joining us now, Chef Peitu Kazimir and Market Manager Adam Sudman. Thank you both for joining me. Appreciate it. Thank you. Um, Thank so, you. Um, Adam, let's, let's start with you. Uh, how much can, you, can, can food teach people about culture? I, I love food as the bridge, right? The big, the big fancy word for this is gastro diplomacy. And we love at the market using food to start conversations. We are curious about our neighbors, but we are also, you know, particularly in this town, we can be a little siloed. We can live, exist in our own little bubble. And that's not as interesting and not as fun way to live. Food's a great way to sort of break that bubble. Hey, too, you you've been serving up uh, food from Haiti. Um, I have a friend born and raised there, and uh, she's been feeding me some dishes. It's uh, fabulous, delicious. What are you doing uh, this Thursday, and how would you how would you kind of explain Haitian food to people? What it's like? Haitian food is like a mixture um, from other countries, like from French. Spanish and um, the Indian. So our spice are different. So this Thursday, we want to serve subjumo. Subjumo is coming from our culture, like our, uh, from our independence. That is one of my favorites, by the way. So um, I, I wish people will be able to uh, stop by there. Um, Adam, what would you say if there's, you know, someone uh, walks away with one or two things from an experience this Thursday, then I think it's the, the following Thursday, different cuisine, and last Thursday in February. We'll get to that in a little bit. What, what do you hope they walk away with from these experiences? Curiosity. Mm. Uh, uh, sated, but maybe not sated quite enough, right? Um, we are curious about our neighbors. We have neighbors from all over the world in in our city. We're really lucky to have that. Um, I hope that you start to learn a, a thing or two about a country, uh, and it can start you searching for more, meeting me, more people, keeping a lookout for people in your own life that, that might be from that place. Hey, too, is it exciting for you to be able to share um, this experience with people from around here? Oh, yes, for sure. Um, on Thursday, I think people are gonna taste it. Some some people um, know about that, but some of them too doesn't know. But they heard they heard about subjumo. So this Thursday, we are gonna try to feed them with subjumo, and then I think it's gonna be a, a good experience for them. So it's an an, an energetic. Um, um, me, um, soup too. So it's a mixture of um, vegetable and beef meat. So for the vegan, they can oh. get it without the meat. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Hey, Adam, I got about uh, 15 seconds here. Give me the uh, hours on Thursday. When should people get there? Is it all day? Is it in the evening? Sure. So it's Taste in the Diaspora, uh, conversations about black history. Uh, Thursday, 6 to 8 p.m., pop in anytime between six and eight. It's gonna be conversation with home chefs and professors down from uh, Department of Acro African American Studies from our friends up at SU. Free sample, free glass of wine from Salt City Bar. Pop in anytime. Adam Sudman, market manager at Salt City. Pay to Kazimir, thank you so much for uh, joining us. Really appreciate it and best of luck on Thursday. Thanks, Jeff. Okay, thanks. I appreciate it.